So I'm sure a lot of people have heard about the whole abortion thing in Texas, you know. After six weeks, you're not allowed to have an abortion. But most women don't even know they're pregnant by six weeks. So basically, it's banning abortion. And it's going to the Supreme Court, and it's affecting a lot of states, where a lot of states are going to implement the same thing. Like, basically, women, you can't have an abortion. And I'm like, I am have mixed emotions about it. Because for me personally, I don't see myself having an abortion. I can't. I can't, because I do believe that life begins at conception. It's just development, you know. You know, things get together. Like it's like for me in my mind it's like saying, Oh, a two year old is not human because it didn't reach maturity. It's not thirty, it's not forty. It's in a developing process, like something that was a fetus is not fully developed, but it's still alive. You know, so for me, I, we all started this way. All of us started this way. So when we were, when we first conceived, we, we weren't not worth anything. Like, listen, it, let me not get into that. It's a whole thing. I, but that being said, I can't speak for other people because for me, if I had an unplanned pregnancy, I'll be okay because I have family support, you know, I'd be okay. So I'm not worried about that there, but there are people who, don't have support and it would be difficult for them to raise a baby and raise a child and all this stuff. So I can't speak. So that's why it's mixed. I can only speak for myself. I know what I would do, but I can't tell someone else, well, because I will do this, you should too. And we don't have the same circumstances in life. It's hard. It's difficult. Also, you know, some, because something is legal, doesn't make it right. That whole argument, it's, Mixed emotions. I just know what I would do. But I know this will affect men a lot. Because men will constantly say, you chose to be a single mother or whatever. And when you hear men says that, they say that they are saying, you could just have aborted our baby. You chose it. You chose to be a single mother. You, I told you, I'm like, I... I pumped and dump. I told you I don't want to be a father. But you chose to be a mother. You didn't abort it. You know, so you chose it. Basically, they're saying you, you have the option to yeet us your fetus and you didn't do it. I'm like, all right. Now, if all this stuff comes to play where most of the states are saying you cannot have abortion anymore. What's the conversation, men? Are you going to still tell this woman? She chose to be a single mother. Now she has no choice, just like you don't. You don't have a choice. And now she doesn't have a choice. A lot of men, are. I think there are more men who are pro-abortion than women. More women are like, nah, no, I'm not, no, not, I'm not going to, I'm not going to, I'm not going to stop my, the development of my baby. I'm not. But men are more. Well, you ch you chose then. <laughs> you you have the option to like kill it. Oh, but Isaac, you you have the abortion to take it out. You know, so mixed emotions. I, and so it's gonna affect women, but it's really gonna affect men. Cause now, guys, you need to, you need to really strap it up. Because now you're gonna be none of you, none of you can use that excuse that a woman chose to be a single mother. You're going to be paying child support out your ass. Because now the woman's going to be like, I can't do shit. <laughs> it's going to affect you guys a lot. Most women, yeah, they're used to, all right, I'm going to have, I'm, I'm not killing my baby. I'm going to have my baby. And those who continue to have their baby, now, now, no, not can. And those who would have had abortion can't. They're gonna look at you like, well, what are you gonna do? I can't have an abortion. 
better 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 pay up it's gonna affect men a lot but you guys don't see that i guess i don't know mixed emotions what do you guys think